हेलो फ्रेंड्स कैसे हैं आप लोग सो so, आज हमारे पास दो टॉपिक हैं टुडे वी हैव टू टॉपिक्स फॉर द निमोनिक पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू इन्फेक्टिव स्टेजेस एंड द इंटरफेरॉन सो आई विल डिस्कस विथ यू एज टू निमोनिक्स फॉर दीज टू टॉपिक्स सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई वुड लाइक टू रिक्वेस्ट यू टू प्लीज लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब एंड हिट द बेल आइकन फॉर ऑल द नोटिफिकेशन फॉर माई अपकमिंग वीडियोज योर लाइक्स एंड कमेंट्स विल इंकरेज मी फॉर मेकिंग मोर वीडियोज सो कीप वॉचिंग and thank you for your support so let's begin these two topics are very important and uh, uh, from micro uh, this is from microbiology topic infective stages we see two stages uh, like uh, a few species they have x as infective stage and other species has larva as their infective stage to kuch mein x infective stage hota hai kuch mein larva so we will see first we will see what all we are discussing about tinea solium tinea saginata echinococcus granulosus which causes hydatid cyst disease in the liver and lungs okay then uh, h nana and d latum so hope this is clear to you five uh, these parasites we are talking about the infective stages of parasite we will call it infective stages of sorry just turn it off make it more clear parasites okay so uh, as this is the egg is infective stage in tinea solium and echinococcus granulosus and h nana then comes the larva larva is infective stage in tinea solium tinea saginata and the last is d latum so this is very confuse confusing so how to remember this with simple mnemonic you have to remember just two lines and one story egg is infective stage in this case larva is infective in this stage i will explain you in both hindi and english so you need to remember tina is a soldier tina is some girl girl's name who is a soldier uh, he she is soldier for her country so tina soldier gives eggs to her nana see uh, uh, tina के नाना को एक्स चाहिए थे सो so, उसके नाना बोलते हैं जाओ बेटा मेरे लिए अंडे लेकर के आओ सो इट गोज लाइक टीना सोल्जर गिव्स एक्स टू हर नाना सो नाउ कम टीना सोल्जर इज फर्स्ट मींस टीनिया सोलियम देन कम्स दी सेकंड थिंग टीना सोल्जर हो गया देन गिव्स एक्स देन रीड इट ई फॉर इकाइनोकॉकस एंड गिव्स फॉर ग्रेन्यूलोस गिव्स एक्स Gives X means Echinococcus granulosus. So this is the third. Here first is this Tinea solium, and third is this Echinococcus granulosus. Please watch till last so that you don't confuse with this thing. To her nana, H E R her means H, then nana means nana. So this is the fourth parasite, and here is the fourth. First, third, and fourth. First, third, and fourth. Tinea soldier is Tinea solium gives X means Echinococcus granulosus and her nana means H nana. So this is the egg. Now we will see in Hindi this X Tinea soldier Tinea soldier उसके नाना को अंडे देती है. Tinea soldier gives X to her nana. Okay. Now comes the larva stage. So larva is positive in Tinea solium, Tinea saginata and the last is D latum. So how to remember this? Tinea's soul same thing. here we remember it soldier and here we remember it is at soul so tinas soul sings sings means sagittarius see sings mein s bhi hai aur g bhi hai and n bhi hai same thing goes here s g and n saginata is something like sings so tinas soul sings largely for her late dada ji isko pehle hum hindi mein dekhte hain taki english mein easy ho tina ki atma largely uske swargi dada ke liye gaati hai Whenever Tina remembers her late uh, grandpa, she her soul sings for her dada ji. So Tina ki atma means Tina's soul. Sorry, Tina's soul largely, largely now largely means L A R lar L A R V A larva for late dada ji. Then uh, swargi means let and dada ji D means dada ji. One second. So guys. Uh, larva means large here large l a r large means l a r larva so tina sol is tinea solium sings means saginata largely means larva for late dada ji means d latum now comes so hope this is clear you need to remember this story in hindi or english whatever way you want now comes the 
uh, interferon part this is the first topic we discussed about the parasite and their infective stage five parasite we read jisme ki egg infective stage hai tina soldier gives sex to her nana and larva stages in tina sol sings largely for her late dadaji aap isko kisi bhi sticker pe likh kar ke ya chote se kagaz pe likh kar ke apne bed ke paas ya apne table ke paas mein chipka sakte hain in teen char reading mein aap isko yaad kar lenge you can put it stick it to your wall near your table or the bed so that you can see it frequently and remember it now comes the interferon interferon is antiviral protein it is in immune system in our body so they largely fight against the viral infection and the tumor infection so this is the concept uh, interferon alpha interferon beta and interferon gamma we have three types of interferon in our body in our immune system so interferon alpha beta and gamma now what they lead to or what they is related to is interferon alpha is related to leukocytes then interferon beta is related to epithelial cells and fibroblast and interferon gamma is related to t cell so how to remember this you need to remember l e f t left interferon alpha beta gamma left so you can just remember interferon left okay so l is leukocyte for interferon alpha e and f is epithelial cells and fibroblast for interferon beta and t cells is related to interferon gamma so i hope this topic is clear to you and uh, please uh, Uh, hit the uh, <coughs> like button and comment in the comment section what other topics you would like to uh, discuss about or the mnemonic uh, you want me to make and upload and uh, <coughs> if any other topic uh, like theory wise or mcq wise if you want to if you want me to discuss or in detail or in easy way uh, so that uh, uh, we can learn it <coughs> so guys keep studying and keep watching my videos and thank you for your liking sharing and subscribing thanks lot guys